everyone and welcome back to my channel Liana's Corner and today I'm just showing you a couple ideas of what I'm using my spare beads for my dome painting. I've got this big um, coffee jar and I'm slowly filling that up. I'm up to that there. So I'm slowly filling that big one up. But I have got some little ones. They came in a pack of five and I have made these. So I'm going to quickly show you how I do it. So if you want you can maybe um, super glue the um, lid down so it doesn't come off but like put something here so you can um, use it for hanging. I'm just going to zoom you in. Okay, so you just want your jar, a little um, tray, and you just get your leftover beads, and you just fill it in. go fancy with these um, put them on the angle to get the different colors like you did when you know when you kiss with the sand or just do basic just fill it on top um, you can get um, different shapes and this was the only one they had at the shop when I want to but um, I'm going to keep my eye out to see if I can find more shapes. And you just keep going until you've got enough beads in. See, these could be cool little um, presents in their own right. Just decorate the outside as well. Maybe put a ribbon or something along there to cover that. Have you tried with um, like these ones? Put the focus. But um, sometimes the outside colours didn't come out, so which made it harder. And it looked a bit icky. So I ran out of colours at this one, so I'm just going to pause it and get some more. So I just got some that I've left in packets. These are the ones that don't have the DMC codes. If you've seen one of my videos, I have, um, sorry, I got my dog on my lap, it's just moving. Um, videos, I've got a container where I keep my DMC drill ones, and these ones I've just kept aside. I can make other stuff with. Oops, I have the wrong frame for you guys. Let's see if I can do this this way. Yeah. So yeah, you put too many in, you can't put your lid. Give me a lid on, so I'm just gonna. you have done so you can do it any way that suits what you are requiring okay, I'm just going to tidy up this mess and I'll be back okay another thing you could do with your leftover bees what I did was I went on to Pinterest and I found some images that 
me and my grandson liked and um, as you can see we printed it out I worked out the size we need it for the rounds and I put double sided tape on it but then I had left over um, clear stuff from the project so I add that on to the picture to protect it so these are the two we've done so far I've done that one that one would have been finished but no I had to wait till he comes back up so hopefully we will complete them later on if you're still interested um, another way I've used my drills is I've made some cards so I've just made this one it's for my daughter's teacher I've used my special drills um, got a couple eyes and then I put a little dot there I have um, put some up here one for eyes, a little nose and I put a little red gem on the bow so I've got one of those special little stars up the top here I use some greens to represent like the leaves and I use those little teardrops, the AB teardrops down there as lights this one had on the stamp like little fairy lights so I just got the really small teardrops and I've added them to the stamp where they were so I've done that this one I've just randomly placed all the jewels on the, the tree to make like, like little fairy lights this one I um, got my tape and I put it like lines and I use my AB drills on that just represent a row of lights <coughs> excuse me and this one I've got a treat but I've used my um, different size just for different like, shapes for lights you know when you go out in the streets you've got different shape lights so I thought I'd do that with that one so they are a few suggestions or ideas that I have personally done if you've done something similar or something completely different please let us know down in the comments section because as we all know we have tons of jewels left that's if you don't throw them away like some do so please leave your ideas of what you can do with your leftover jewels down below and you haven't already make sure you click the subscribe button and the notification bell just to keep up to date of what videos i have coming out and i hope you have a great day and i'll talk to you later bye